Hey Tim Boo, I'm Yubo Mastery and I will be the test your tester for West Kai this season. So, you requested a Super Boo transformation tournament. So, we are going to have Super Boo and just default AI versus Gotenks Boo. And then we're going to do Gohan Boo versus Super Boo and then Gotenks Boo versus Gohan Boo. And we're just going to go ahead and see which Boo is the best. So, as you guys know, I am on Team Boo, so, you know, this actually has something to do with me. I'm going to give a little bit of input. I'm actually looking forward to... I'm, I'm, I'm putting my money with Gotenks Boo. I think that he'll do really well. And I'm not sure about, uh, <laughs> about just uh, Super Boo, regular Super Boo. So as you can see, uh, Gotenks Boo has a really fast melee. He's just overall impressive. I think bringing him back for uh, Season 6 might do us some good. You know, he definitely helped us win Season 2, so the return of Gotenks Boo might be really helpful. His charge rate is fast. Faster than any of the other forms of Boo from what I've seen. So Boo is doing pretty impressive as well, though. Uh, my problem with Super Boo is that his B2s are just... Eh. His ultimate is a suicide ultimate, so he's kind of like Majin Vegeta. Genocide Blast, his signature move, and he's going to get... Super Kamehameha in the face! Beautiful. That's the Out of all the Super Boo forms, uh, definitely uh, Gotenks Boo has the best in my opinion. Just Super Kamehameha, cutscene, no charge, just launch it. Just beautiful. Beautiful damage right there. Yeah, Special Beam Cannon, which is, uh, you know, stronger than Super Kamehameha. Oh, he missed that. And uh, Galactic Donut, which is an awesome uh, B2 as well, so... He also has health recovery. Up, oh, another genocide blast. Will this connect? It connected a little bit. It connected for like 3k. So he might as well done trap shooter or uh, uh, what's that move called? Expanding energy wave. That's what it's called. All right. Well, Super Boom is low on HP. Oh, we saw another Super Combo. Oh, dodge it. Yes, he dodged it. All right. Another genocide blast for like 3k again and that's at max power a little bit of melee come on go tanks boo I'm biased but you should be able to end this you don't always have to charge up and do a soaker commonly how you have other b2s as well and they're all good they're all good if you want to do a rebirth you can pull it off explosive wave pretty good b2 I mean b1 Chocolate Beam, and I think Super Boo just won. Wow, alright. <laughs> you know what, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna chalk that up to the... I'm gonna chalk that up to the AI. I, 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 I wanna rematch. I wanna rematch. I don't know. I'm gonna chalk it up to the AI, because I know Gotenks Boo can win. <laughs> and grab. Come on, go tanks, boo. You can take this to three. Come on. Don't tell me you're going to get beat by a genocide blast. But I'd say Super Boo is probably the weakest one. Uh, and definitely not the one we want. Genocide blast sucks. Uh, one of the reasons why we're taking, we're considering Gohan Boo off is because Chocolate Beam is not that good. And, and his ultimate is a suicide. So, you know, so far not that impressed. 1,500 points of damage. Not that impressive. Super, Go Super Boo has already done two B2s and hasn't even dropped Gotenks Boo down by a bar. Galactic Donut! Ooh, he dodged it. Nice dodge, Super Boo. Next time get hit. <laughs> oh, I'm so biased. I just want Gotenks Boo to return. So, literally, Gotenks Boo has caught all the way up to uh, Super Boo with just melee. None of his B oh, he's only done one B2 and, and it didn't hit. Another genocide blast. Shocked. For uh, 2,500 points of damage. Rush out. Lock him down. Get a little bit of melee in. Nice melee combo. 13 hits for uh, almost 5k points of damage. Come on, Gotenks, boo. Do something. I, don't, uh, I can definitely tell you, we're probably not going to go with default AI if we choose him. So far, I'm not really impressed with the default AI. Max power, genocide blast. C 
connects for I don't know how many points of damage. There are too many numbers. Not not a lot. I can tell you, not a lot. Special beam cannon! Whew! For 9k points of damage. And a little bit of juggling. Three hits for 4k points of damage. Alright, just just throw a galactic donut at him and end this. I don't even know why. Special Beam Cannon and it's over. Gotenks Boo wins round two, so we're taking it to round three. Sorry, them genocide blasts. They're just they're just not doing it. Super Boo starting it off strong. Nice melee combo. About a half a bar of damage. Another genocide blast. Connects for I don't know, like 1,500. Not that impressive. You know, definitely what we need on Team Boo right now is some good B2ers, and I think Gotenks Boo will definitely be a good B2er. Yeah. He doesn't have a super explosive wave as an ultimate. He actually has a good ultimate, you know? We don't have a lot of people who have a good ultimate. We have, what, super explosive wave, of course, we have Kid Buu with his Planet Burst, or Super Ghost Kamikaze Attack, so... Just having a Super Kamehameha as an ultimate, you know, I could definitely go with that. Gotenks Buu is already caught up and has surpassed the damage that Super Buu has done, and hasn't even done any Buu 2s. Grabbed by Super Buu. Wonder if he has any. If he, has, I can't. I wasn't really paying attention. Does he have a stretchy arm grab? Because I'm not a big fan of the stretchy arm grabs. Rebirth. Ooh, back to full health. That costs four bars. All right, so that's a good reference for uh, for Team Boo. Four bars. Uh, four blast stocks to get rebirth. So I think that that pretty much has guaranteed uh, Go Tanks Boo the win here. <laughs> that rebirth. That that should be another key reason why we should choose him. You know, he got banned before because they thought w they believe we have too many uh, healing characters, but uh, they released us. All right, like 1,500 points of damage, yay! Go Tanks Boo is not doing a lot of B2s. You know, find the right AI. I'd like to see him throw out, you know, a lot of donuts and special beam cannons, charge up and blast his ultimate. Oh, there's a galactic donut. Dodged. No, it doesn't look like he has a stretchy arm grab, so that's good. Just looks like he has like a regular grab, so that's good, because not a big fan of stretchy arm grab, because you can reach past them, and that sucks. 14 hit combo for uh, almost 5k points of damage. You know, overall, I'm really impressed with Gotenks Boo. He's a great beat He looks like he can have a good melee game, so if need be, we can make him a meleeer in a, a couple matches as well. It looks like he might have this locked down. Oh, come on, just end it. One more punch. There we go. So, Gotenks Boo is the winner between the fight uh, uh, between Super Boo and Gotenks Boo. So, we're going to go ahead and move on to the fight between Gohan Boo and Super Boo. Alright, so, we got Gohan Boo, oh, of course, with uh, default AI, versus Super Boo with default AI. Let's begin. So, like I said, the least likely one that I think is going to win is going to be Super Boo. I think that he's just going to get 0-2. Oh, like, he, 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 he's not going to do it. Because Gohan Boo, he has he has a great melee game, like, I think, in my opinion. So, go ahead, Gohan Boo. Show us why you should still be on the team. Uh, I think that Gotenks Boo has a faster melee combo than uh, Gohan Boo. Uh, but we'll just have to find out next round. Where it'll be Gohan Boo versus Gotenks Boo. And then a little fun fact is that uh, every single time a uh, Super Boo absorbs someone, he gets more and more human look. Like look, like look at Super Boo and look at Gohan Boo. Like Super Boo, he doesn't even look like he could even pass for a human. You know, Gohan Boo, he, he you know, if he wasn't pink, he can you know, have facial structure. 
Alright, well, you got suicide and you got super ghost, so you know what, how about neither of you do it? Alright, well, nice job reducing your HP. Nice job reducing your HP. Super Kamehameha in the- and he eats it for 11k points of damage. Genocide Blast. And you do a B1. You're, you're just cocky, just cocky. But it was only 12 points of damage. Super Kamehameha versus Genocide Blast, and Super Kamehameha gets it. Oh my god, Super Boo. <laughs> your chances of being on this team for Season 6 are slipping, sir. Slipping away. Gohan Boo showing off why he should be on the team with a nice melee combo. Both going up to max power, so I guess I guess you're gonna do your uh, ultimate super boo. Mine as well. Mine as well. Nope, chocolate beam, and it's over. <laughs> and super boo has disappeared from existence. <laughs> All right, let's fight again. Are we gonna see Gohan Boo just two O super boo? He just ate that Super Kamehameha. Dropping a couple frames here. Oh, there we go. Hmm, Gohan Boo didn't even decide to recover, right? Genocide Blast! Super Kamehameha! <laughs> that was smart, Gohan Boo. That was smart. Another Genocide Blast. Super Kamehameha again? No, he's just gonna be like, no, I'm just gonna move out of the way. Ah, uh, yeah, he took a couple to the chin. It's like, go Super Boo, are you just gonna spam Genocide Blast? You know you have another B2. You know you have a Chocolate Beam, right? Super Kamehameha! He's just not learning! Gohan Boo is smarter than you! <laughs> After Image! Hit him away. Uh, I just actually thought of something. Uh, if we were going to give anybody a B1 build, I think it should be, actually, it should be, uh, and Gohan Boo is going to stay, it should be Gohan Boo. Wow, it's over already. Not even a bar of health. Uh, before I, before I move on. Uh, Gohan Boo, he has after image, so, you know, maybe B1 build on him might be good if we decide to keep him. You know, uh, after image, in my opinion, is better than Wild Scent, so, you know, maybe we could take advantage of that, but then he might just spell, spam the hell out of his, uh, his tension move, so, I don't know. Alright, so let's go ahead and see the final fight between Gohan Boo and Gotenks Boo. Alright, last one, we got Gohan Boo, of course, on default, versus Gotenks Boo, so let's see which one can pull it off. Uh, we already saw that the calculations, that's their damage difference isn't by much, maybe like by a thousand, and that's really not something that we should take into consideration when choosing. So, let's see if, uh, Gotenks Spook can pull off, Special Beam Cannon misses, but his charge rate is, uh, better than Gohan Boo's in my opinion. Special Beam Cannon, charge it up, and he misses, and counters with Super Kamehameha, and dodges, oh my god. This fight is starting off strong, it just seems like a lot of B2s. Gotenks Boo jumps back and donut. Gotenks Boo is about a bar ahead right now. Barely gotten touched so far. Super explosive wave, knock him back. Come on, go come on, you two, come on. Gohan Boo showing why he's so devastating with his melee game. About 7k points of damage, charging up to max power. We're gonna see a Super Ghost Kamikaze attack. Please don't. Please don't. Special Beam Cannon connects before the Chocolate Beam can. And now he is over a bar down in health. A grab, no follow up. And Gohan Boo from behind. Gotenks Boo about a bar ahead. You guys want to gain some key? Dodging and blocking and dodging and blocking and dodging. <laughs> but Gotenks Boo wins that fray. Gohan Boo grabs. 
Any follow up? No. Nope. Kind of misses a kick. Really unimpressive. <laughs> Go Tanks Boot charging up. Go Hun Boot knocks him down. A little bit of charging. Special Beam Cannon. Not even close to connecting. Really far distance. Special Beam Cannon misses again. I like how he's quick firing them, but you know, you might want to get a little bit closer with it. Uh, Gohan Boo is behind Gotenks Boo and is doing his impressive melee combo and has pretty much evened out this fight with just melee. Oh, well, we need a good melee. -er. Super Kamehameha does not connect. I thought maybe it would, it did not. So, they are both charging up to max power. Uh, any ultimate connecting will end this, so this might be it, guys. Go Tanks Boo, you want to jump back and do a Super Kamehameha? You know how much you like Super Kamehameha. Gohan Boo does high tension, still in max power. Both in max power. Super Kamehameha connects before the Galactic Gun can go off, and Gohan Boo takes round one. Close fight, close fight. But if that Galactic Donut would have connected, I think Go Tanks Boo would have had it. He just didn't go on boot side to quick fire that uh, that Kamehameha. Good decision. If they would have, you know, if he would have done special beam cannon, quick fired it, and special beam cannon would have won. So you know, take that in consideration. That special beam cannon goes through Super Kamehameha. Right. Special beam cannon misses again. Come on, Go Tanks Boo. You gotta use those. You gotta use them wisely. Nice melee combo from Gohan Boo, of course. That's his thing. You know, if, we, if, we ever, if we ever need a good melee, Gohan Boo will be our guy, because impressive. He was even impressive in the gauntlet, taking out uh, Go Gogeta, so, by himself. But Gotenks Boo is going to show that he is no slouch when it comes to melee. He, he's keeping up. He's charging up, going to max power. Will we see a Super Kamehameha? After image, blocks the grab, gets knocked away still. Running out of max power, go tanks, boo. You gonna do something with it? No, he does nothing with his max power, and he. They're about even, they're about even right now. Come on, good. Galactic Donut connects! For. 7.5k points of damage. Charging back up. Both go into max power. A Super Kamehameha from Gotenks Boo will end it. So... Actually, almost any B2 at this point, if it connects, will end it. Throw? No follow-up? Okay. Special Beam Cannon misses Super Ghost Kamikaze attack. Will it connect? No. Blows up on the ground. You're not helping your case, Gohan Boo. <laughs> you wouldn't have connected anyway because he moved, but seriously, for them to explode on the ground, ah, oh my god. Gotenks Boo wins with two bars of health left. We are going into round three. This time I won't go easy on you. <laughs> Weakling, are you really in such a hurry to die? Ooh, so Gohan Boo's talking all that good shit. He said he was going easy on him last time, but he was like, uh, Gotenks Boo was like, are you ready to die? Call him a weakly, despite him being the stronger form of him. We do have transformations turned off, of course. I know there was a previous test that a long while ago between these two, and they had transformations on, and Gotenks Boo kept on turning into Gohan Boo, and it was Gohan Boo versus Gohan Boo, which pretty much tells us nothing. Special Mutant Cannon dodged. Gohan Boo doing his impressive melee combo. Oh, but Gotenks Boo said, I am no slouch in the melee game and I will ping pong you. Gotenks Boo is pulling in the lead about a bar. He's going to show Gohan Boo that, you know what, absorbing Gohan, well, not even worth it, man. I'm stronger when I just got Gotenks. But Gohan Boo showing that he's no slouch once again. Nice melee combo. Chocolate Beam connects. Both charging up. 
Special Beam Cannon misses again. It's not connecting with them Special Beam Cannons. Gohan Boo at max power. Gotenks Boo at max power. We got a clash. Gohan Boo wins. Gotenks Boo dodges. Both running out of attention. Does not pull it off. Nice melee combo by Gotenks Boo. Gotenks Boo jump back. Super connects with the Galactic Donut. Explodes. Oh my god. Is this it? Does Gotenks Boo got it? Super combo behind. Uh, connects, but the wall. And... Uh, come on. Come on. Wow, come on. This is ridiculous. Come on, Gotenks Boo. Just end it. He's, he has nothing left. Just end it. Done. Gotenks Boo wins. Alright, so I hope this test was helpful. I hope it convinced you that Gotenks Boo should be our man. He he beat both of them. He's the only one to beat both Super Boo and Gohan Boo. So, I hope you enjoyed this test. I hope it was helpful. Once again, thank you for choosing me, well, you actually didn't choose me, but, uh, you know, thank you for, uh, having me as your tester for Westcott Division. Thank you for watching, and I am looking forward to your next test. Thanks for watching.